hi everybody i really hope you're well it's lexi it is the most stunning day here in the uk and i wanted to bring through some light language for this beautiful super full moon in aquarius on the 12th super super excited the energy has been really powerful since Lionsgate so I hope that you're resting that you're integrating that you're taking time to ground and most of all that you're enjoying what's going on at the moment we are here on earth at a, an incredible time um, I'm being really positive about it at the moment. I can feel myself getting really excited about it. I know there are times when it is really, really tough and we can't always be a super positive poly, but there is something about being out in nature. There's something about being sat on the grass uh, with your phone propped up some couple of yoga blocks and just being outside in this most amazing and incredible energy at the moment even though that there are trucks going through the village where i live and all sorts of noises going on it's just utterly blissful to connect with nature and one of the messages that have been really coming through is that we will start to change our relationship with earth we'll start to change our relationship with nature it could be in the way that we eat uh, the way that we use earth's resources but also and more importantly for me it's the way we start connecting into earth energy where we get out of bed every morning swing our legs down put our feet on the floor and just start to feel into the energy of the day I am super lucky that I can bring out my cup of tea on a morning and just put my feet on the grass and just listen to what the earth is saying. This is where we need to start working in harmony with her rather than working against her and resources and things that we've taken for granted are going to change and going to move over the next few months going into next year. So start thinking about what tiny changes you can make to make your life more in tune with earth and that could be against the current narrative it could be doing something completely different that um isn't part of how should we say a greenwashing agenda it is about you truly connecting in with earth listening to what she has to say and then moving forward with that and taking empowered action to align yourself with her energy and the more and more that we do that the more we create amazing harmonious communities who are all working together who are working for the earth and these communities of light are just starting to pop up you will really notice post Lionsgate that your soul family your soul groupings the people who align with you on the vibe of vibrational level who have got the same essence are starting to really gather around us it's going to be a really special second part of the year even though the 3d is going to really ping in some absolute humdingers should we just say i feel like in the energy but we just need to be in our hearts we need to sit down on earth and just listen to what she has to say so a lot more than I was anticipating to say, but it just feels so important to get her message across. So I just want to go into a little bit of light language for this beautiful full moon in Aquarius. And just listen to the words, listen to the nature around me. Let's hope there are no big trucks, but just let it raise your vibration. So closing your eyes. Just settling your feet down into earth if you can. Taking a breath and just relaxing, shrugging your shoulders, rolling your neck. Feel yourself deeply connecting into the energy. Ikola isunta, kikala ikora ikataisa. Kila e kala, kala ki kisote ikrate, ikrate ke. 
So just letting those energies rest let them move into every cell of your body just gently taking a deeper inhale exhaling then when you're ready to wiggle your fingers and toes just gently bringing yourself back to wherever you are and that was quite a quite a heady experience very very high vibrational intense energy felt very very different i'm quite glad i'm sat on the floor at the moment take some time drink some water ground yourself just allow yourself to be just for a few minutes before you go into the hustle and bustle of whatever is next in your day that message was very much from the heart of the universe just reminding you of your ability to live from your heart to crack us open to our own potential to crack us open into a higher dimensional frequency a uh, frequency where we live from our heart so please enjoy make sure you drink plenty of water and ground yourself and if you do have a moment to like to comment to subscribe i'd be really grateful but wishing you the happiest for me and i will see you all very very soon go out and enjoy the sunshine if you can as well it really is um really powerful and potent sending you so much love take care